<laughs> hey guys, Heen from Road. And Jules. And Ming. If you could only pick one mic for filmmaking, what would it be? A video mic! So we use the Rode video mic range every single day. They're super versatile mics. They're easy, they're very affordable, and they're just great for run and gun filming. And they've become the go-to across the board. That being said, the video mic is not just an on-camera mic. With some creative thinking, there are so many different ways you can use it. Let's check it out. So not only is it an on-camera microphone, but you can actually take it off and put it on something like a Gorillapod here by Joby, and then use the VC1 extension cable. And this setup makes it super flexible for any off-camera application. And you don't even have to use a camera. You can use the SC4 cable to record straight into a mobile device. You can even use your video mic to record straight into your computer if you're recording, say, like a podcast or gameplay capture. Uh, what we've got here is a video mic go and that is plugged into the SC2 cable, which comes with the mic. And then in turn, that goes into the SC4 adapter. For that to work, you just need to make sure that your laptop or computer has the right input. Okay, let's hear how this sounds. Yo, Jules here on the podcast. Like and subscribe. One, two, one, two. <laughs> this is the worst podcast ever. <laughs> Handheld as a reporter mic. Hey, Jules. Hey. <laughs> Welcome to my closet. So you're probably wondering why I'm in a closet. Well, they act as a great non-reverberant space and the clothes stop the sound from bouncing around too much. And why I like them is because everyone has a closet, they're super accessible, and it's a great DIY solution for recording VO at home. Um, the setup I have is a VMP Plus, a Joby Gorillapod, and a VC1 cable. So we're going to take a listen now to what it sounds like. Check, check, two and two. Welcome to my closet. Guys, can you let me out now? <laughs> a great way to get more control over the sound effects in your films is to record Foley. And you can actually do that with your video mic. And what we've got here is a video micro and we're going to use it to record Foley for a scenario that we filmed the other day in La Perouse. The shot involves a person walking over gravel, so we've got a Foley pit filled with gravel, and we're going to use the video micro plugged into an SC7 cable going into an SC6 adapter, and that's going to be plugged into a smartphone. So thankfully someone's offered me a shoe, so I'm going to use that to recreate the footsteps. Let's have a listen. So you can even use the video mic here with the micro boom pole. What we've done is use a VC1 cable to attach to a camera, and that enables us to get this video mic nice and close to the subject, which gives us really nice crisp dialogue. We've also got the pivot adapter here, which gives us the right angle whenever we're overhead with the mic as well. You're in this shot. Oh, as well. am I? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Just like oh in the background. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, let's take a listen. <laughs> check, check, two, two. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Another really cool thing that you can do with the video mic is make it completely wireless. So, what I'm going to do here is lose the VC1 cable. And I've got with me the Wireless Go new product, perfect for this kind of application. What I'm going to do is mount that onto a cold shoe mount that we've attached to the video mic. I'm going to plug in the 3.5 mil cable. And what that's doing now is transmitting wirelessly from the video mic to a receiver. So I do have that receiver here. And on the other end, we can plug that into our DSLR, get the 3.5 mil cable into the same input. And there you have it. We have a completely wireless setup with the video mic. So guys, 
As with all these scenarios, it's important to remember that you should always get the mic as close to the sound source as possible. So there's a lot of mics in the video mic range and today we've only shown you a handful. So stay tuned because we have more videos on the way. So that wraps it up. We'd love to know how you've been using the video mic range as well. So hit us up in the comments below and remember to like and subscribe. See you guys.